this is my makeup tutorial and we're going to start off with the cover fx primer and we're putting that in our t-zone which is on the forehead um, the nose and the cheek areas and then on the chin and we're going to rub all that in to get into your pores and then we're going to be taking a milani lip chapstick lip product thing and we're going to put that on our lips and then next we're going to be taking the born this way foundation by Too faced and we're going to pump that on the back of our hands and then put it all over our face so that our face looks smooth and then we're going to take the shape tape concealer by Tarte and we're going to put that under our eyes on the forehead, down the bridge of the nose, on any acne, and on the chin. And on our eyelids to prime the eyelids for later. And we're going to use our beauty blender and blend that out. Make sure that it's all blended. That's Carly. <laughs> and then we're taking the Laura Mercier powder and we're going to bake under our eyes. So now we're going to bake under our eyes and we're also going to bake on our chin and any places that are going to crease on our nose and on our forehead. And then we're going to take my Milani powder and this powder brush and I'm going to put the powder all over my face to set the foundation and I'm going to wipe off the powder that is still on my face. Now I'm putting it on my forehead, wiping off my nose powder, wiping off my crease powder, and then under my eyes, wiping that off. And then I'm going to take the NARS bronzer with a little Morphe bronzer brush, and we're going to put that in the contours of our cheeks to make us seem like our faces chiseled we're gonna put it on our forehead too and then on our nose and then we're gonna blend it down the neck and make it look like we have a jawline and then I'm blending that out a little bit with my beauty blender to make it look more smooth and then I'm taking this palette and it's a highlight and contour palette and I'm using the highlight shade and highlighting my cheekbones and then I'm going to highlight my nose and now I'm taking my Anastasia brow pomade and some brow brushes and I'm going to fill in my right eyebrow first just like that making it seem a little bit more darker and more filled in and make it the shape that I want it to be. And now we're done with that eyebrow. We're going to brush it out a little bit. And then we're going to start on the other one. And we're doing the same thing, just making it seem more dark and make it the shape that we want it to be. And we're gonna brush that one out too. And that's it. Now we're taking this BoxyCharm eyeshadow palette and we're gonna be taking the nude shade and putting that on our eyelid to set the concealer that was on there. Doing that on both eyes, and we're taking the top eyeshadow, the orangey one, and we're going to put that in the crease. And now I am taking this brown shade, and we're putting that in the crease also. Now I'm taking the bottom shade, the white one, and we're going to put that in our inner corners as highlight so that it makes our inner corners pop. 
and then I'm taking that same highlight palette with the same shade that we did our cheekbone highlight and our nose highlight with and putting that underneath my brow on my brow bone to make my brow stand out. Now we're going to take the all nighter setting spray and we're going to spray our face and set all the makeup in place. And then I'm taking this pretty vulgar um, eyeliner and we're going to put that in our waterline on both eyes. And we're also going to put it in our tight line on both eyes. And now I'm taking my Lash Paradise mascara and I'm going to put those on my eyelashes, my top and bottom eyelashes. There you go. And now I'm taking a Milani lip gloss and putting that on my lips. And this is my finished look. Thank you for watching and goodbye.